Yo, 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 what's going on out there, universe? It's your boy! Fast is Sith, the Galactic Emperor himself, the Sith Lord of the Orville, King of Fucking Up! <laughs> What's going on out there, out there YouTube? Uh, how you guys been, man? You know, like I said, I, I've there's been a couple times where I've said on this channel that I'm going to start, I'm going to start, I'm going to start, I'm going to start. And, you know, there's a few things I want to talk about. So, number one is, you know, motivation level. Like, you know, people really underestimate, like, motivation level and your reason why and why you want to do something and you know what's driving you and and all you know like the, your motivation is the key when it comes to weight loss and you know two years ago in 2014 when I originally started my journey you know and you guys you know saw you know all the fails and you know the lack of progress and the lack of gains and you know the lack of me letting go of weight you know um you know that that really was like a real slap in the face to me and it took me a while to mentally recover now fortunately most of the people that I messed with on YouTube were very supportive but you know you got a few haters here and there giving you feedback you know and in my head I always had this thing of like I have to do it this way I have to do it that way I gotta do this I gotta do that this has to be right and you know I came to a realization this year Especially when I got to my heaviest weight of 660, you know, approaching the 700 club, which is a, a hell to the gnaw. I was like, you know, I, I can't, I can't sit around no more. I can't, you know, wait for the right opportunity. I can't wait until I have enough money. I can't wait until I have the right clothes or all, all this other shit that was just, you know, distracting me from my goal. And it's funny because when you see yourself, you know, talking about things and and how you feel about things and and you know you just see your like mental progression and over these past two and a half years i've made a lot of mental jumps you know i've, I've been reading books a lot more you know not this week because i've been kind of busy but you know i'm gonna get back on my book grind next week um you know i started a new business you know um the the hermit or uh, hermit consulting inc and actually you're gonna see uh you know me I'm not really going to cross promote it too much, but I'm going to be starting a new YouTube channel here very soon. So uh, be on the lookout for that, you know, and I might uh, keep you guys updated on that because, uh, you know, the business that I'm starting is going to be able to help a lot of people and, you know, it's going to be able to bring in some income so I can do the things that I want to do. Um, I've also been, you know, learning about, you know, financial wealth and, you know, and, and one of the key concepts that kept popping up, you know, here and there was health, 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 health. You know, your health is your wealth, you know, and if you don't take care of yourself, then, you know, who's going to take care of you? So, I've, uh, you know, recently just was like, fuck it, you know what I'm saying? I'm just going to do it, you know, and I, I'm going to, you know, document as much as I can on, on Instagram and Facebook and you know, I had to pawn my camera because the nigga was going through some things. Um, you know, so I got my camera back. You know, money's good now. You know, situation is, is stabilized. And, you know, more, more importantly, my mental has been stabilized. And I really found my why. And my why is, is because I want to be able to do normal things that normal people do. You know, when you are this size and you're this morbidly obese, most people result to surgery. You know, now fortunately, I'm not one of those people on my 600 pound life, you know, dodge the bullet. You know, my 600 pound life that, you know, are immobile and, and can't, you know, get up and do things or, you know, they have to have assistance or they have, they have to have wheelchairs. Now, I will admit at times, you know, I have had to you know use the driving card in, in the stores and stuff like that but you know well, recently i said fuck it you know no so, pain no gain basically like i was saying you know i decided hey let's start small you know everybody used to say start small start small start small 
know, start by walking, start by doing this. And I, I never understood because, you know, I understood how the metabolic rates work and, you know, calorie and calorie expenditure and all that. But, you know, I never really considered the afterburn effect. And that's what Jerry Ward always used to talk about when it comes to cardio. And so I was like, fuck it, man. I got to do something. I cannot just sit on the couch and keep getting bigger and, and eating and, and, you know, and just and just feeling sorry for myself and feeling stupid you know so I said fuck it let's let's go walking you know what I'm saying it's summertime here you know you can't really see it right now I mean because I'm it's kind of dark in my house we have like you know uh, blackout curtains and shit but I've kind of moved them so the lighting should be decent but you know so I started walking you know and I was like okay you know my goal right now immediately is to you know walk around this track four times you know, and I've gotten up to three. I've gotten up to three, you know, and I had I have to start and stop because, you know, my, my back gets fatigued really easily. But, you know, funny thing is weight started coming off, you know, and my diet has not been the best. You know, I have not been like eating bro or if it fits your macros or anything. I just kind of, you know, just ate. I haven't ate what I, I've eaten what I've wanted to, but I've eaten it on a smaller scale. And on top of that, you know, I'm drinking water now, which is like hella good. You know, I've made it my goal to get a gallon a day um, recently. You know, I, I started out with 64 ounces, which is like a little under half a, a half a gallon. Um, and then, you know, now I'm moving up to a gallon. So I got to drink four uh, cups a day of water, like these 30 ounce cups. So, you know, rough, roughly, or, and you know, and then I count the water at the gym too. So, you know, I've, I've gotten close. I get about 92 to you know 70 72 to 92 you know gallons i mean ounces of water a day you know depending on you know if i remember or not I mean, you know i'm drinking water with meals now i've been drinking less soda you know even diet soda i haven't been drinking that much um so it's it's i'm, I'm making small strides you know and uh, i watched an anime called uh, baby steps. I don't know if you ever seen it, but it's about this uh, this kid in high school. He's very fastidious. He's very you know dutiful. He's very you know study conscious. You know he was just basically excellent at studying. He never like really branched out to do anything. And then you know one day you know he meets this girl and she's into tennis. And then he gets into tennis and you know and then he becomes a tennis star throughout the anime. But the main uh, the main plot of the story is baby steps lead to giant strides that's the like you know mantra of the anime and i've adopted that mantra as what i'm doing you know what i'm saying i can't sit here and be like oh you know i'm gonna go into the gym and go hard for an hour and a half and you know i'm gonna go do this I, my whole programming was on some bodybuilder type shit when i should be on some my body type shit and i knew this but you know, when you knowing and doing is two different things. You can know something very well and not execute at all. You know what I'm saying? You you got a lot of smart, dumb motherfuckers. You know, and excuse my language, but you know, I'm talking to y'all. Y'all my homies. Y'all are my my people. You know, y'all know me. You know, most of y'all follow me on Facebook. You know what I'm saying? And a few of you that don't, uh, you should. You know, which is down into the description as always. Um, but you know, I was you know very very uh not aware of what my body and limitations are you know what i'm saying so i had to focus on what i can do like even my new programming is going to be different you know which i will talk about in um uh another video i'm not gonna talk about my programming right now but you know this was just an update so you know i'm starting i'm walking i got a membership at planet fitness some of you may know excuse the airplane because i live semi close to the airport so sometimes planes fly over um, but, um, uh, what was I saying? Um, oh, so the direction of the channel, what, what I'm going to be doing, what I'm going to be focusing on. The main things I want to focus on in this channel, on this channel is me hitting PRs. I do want to do some workout videos. I want to vlog more. Like I want to take you guys outside. I'm going to take you guys to the track and stuff, and you guys can see what I do out out there on the track and, and what it's like and all that. And you know, a lot of you said I should try, probably do a cookbook. Uh, I'm actually going to do a free cookbook called the Sis Cookbook. Um, you know, very soon. So be on the lookout for that. Um, you know, I'll show you my Rio Zombolic programming. Um, you know, because right now I'm in a hyperbolic time chamber, and and you know I've lost you know a little, a little pretty close to 15 pounds in the last three weeks. You know, um, I had lost. It's funny because I was doing the squat challenge with my best friend, 
and I lost like 30 pounds from doing that. And then, you know, of course, I gained it all back because, you know, I got depressed that she stopped doing it with me. So, you know, I've been fighting. I've been fighting for three years almost to get under 620 pounds. And I'm right now I weighed myself this morning. Uh, I'm 629.8. So uh, I got, you know, roughly 11 more pounds to go to be under 620 and you know I'm I'm ready man I'm ready to I'm ready to crush it you know uh, you know 599 you know that that's that's been in my head for a really long time that's what excuse me that's what I wanted to do 2 years ago the lessons that I learned from from 2 years ago and when I when I lost the most weight in my life when I was 400 when I was 500 and I went to like 400 pounds is you know I was on a low carb diet of course uh, I was uh, walking. I was walking like almost an hour to hour and fifteen minutes at the gym. You know, I would be on the treadmill. I'd be watching TV or whatever, and just walking on the treadmill. And then I would do I would do workouts. And uh, that's what I got to get back to. I got to start, you know, uh, doing my you know walking and stuff, and then you know then do my workouts. You know, but what, how I plan on planning planning it is if I'm gonna do legs, I'm gonna do legs at the beginning of the beginning of you know going to the gym then I'm going to do my walking because you know if I don't then I'm not going to want to squat and so and then if I leave my walking or my cardio till after my workouts I'm not going to want to do it either so I got to do both those knock those out the way then I can go to training maybe that might not work for some people I'm not really trying to make gains I'm just trying to stimulate muscle you maintain the muscle that I have maybe get some hypertrophy if possible but I'm not really going for hypertrophy right now it's just about fat loss getting smaller you know right now my goal is to get to 599 before Christmas, you know, like 590. That that's my Christmas present to myself. I want to be under 599. Now, if I hit the goal before then, then I want to be under 550 by Christmas. And the way that I'm going now, I could hit 599 by the end of August or maybe even the end of July. No, not I won't say the end of July. I'll say August. The end of August. So, that's my immediate goals now my grand goal most of you should know if you've been following me for any length of time is I want to get to 230 so you know 230 is the overall goal in two years it still is and I have a bunch of like smaller goals into that you know being able to do a push-up being able to do pull-ups being able to do reverse grip pull-ups being able to do you know run a mile without stopping being able to walk a mile without stopping being able to uh, you know, uh, pi uh, jump onto a box again. Um, all kinds of little goals that I have. Um, you know, I actually want to run a marathon. Uh, that's another one of my goals. You know, for like a 5K or something, something small, not not too fucking big. You know, um, and you know that's about it. What have you guys been up to? What have you been doing? I've seen a lot of people. Uh, that I used to follow on YouTube had taken a break, uh, but they're coming back. Like my boy Daniel John, shout out to you. Low T Rob doesn't make any videos anymore. Uh, there's a lot of guys I used to fuck with. Uh, you know, um, uh, Average Joe, he's not making videos anymore. I started watching YouTube videos. Uh, you know, I've been catching up with Chris Jones and Pump Jacers and, and the Hodge Twins. You know, the two guys that really kind of inspired this journey. Uh, on YouTube, you know, Low Carb Corey. I haven't even seen what Low Carb Corey is doing. I actually had unsubscribed from him for a while. So, that's what I've been up to. I uh, hope this video wasn't too long. It's going on about, you know, probably 10 plus minutes. But, you know, I had to get a lot of information out there. So, if you got any questions, musings, you know, opinions, uh, hate, whatever the fuck you want to do, put it down in the comments section. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it um it's been a little while and i'm rusty but as always all of my social media links are down into the description so be sure to add your boy but anyway this is elevation aka fastest sith be good or be good at it bitches and remember that baby steps lead to giant strides i will see you in the next video